Yo, what is up guys, my name is Moondog, and welcome back to Telltale's The Walking Dead Season 2. Uh, now we're going to be doing Episode 2. Now, like the last episode, the entire second episode is going to be one video, so let's just get right into it. Yeah, uh, Episode 2, House Divided. Play. Alright, I'm going to take these bad boys on. Get these bad boys on. Alright. Last, last episode, a lot happened, man. On the walking dead. It's gonna show us. <laughs> Freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington. Mm. Then talk to me about cold. I'm gonna go and look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I, I'm by myself. Bullshit. Krista, Definitely run! wasn't as much money. I can barely tell what's on the screen because of it. So, since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? Maybe I could stay here for a little bit, if that's all right. I've got no problem with it. Jesus, Mary, and Joseph. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? Who's Carver? You were in the woods with Krista. Always. Krista dead. Yeah, I'm he fine. gets bit. Just, just lost my footing. Damn it! God damn it! Come this way! Damn it! You get your asses over here, both of you! Well, shit. Alright. Back into it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Also, in the last episode, I kept calling Clementine Ellie. Well, hopefully that won't happen this time. Side, we can't get through them. What are you looking at? Uh, your bite, your obvious bite. <laughs> Staring ain't polite. Come on out and say it. How are you feeling? Well, other than this bite, I'm just peachy. Hand me that there. Yeah. Uh. Are you sure? I got nothing to lose. Other than the piggly wigglies, of course. Yeah, I guess. Hmm. Oh. Yeah, you can't do it, can you? Uh, bleed out like a stuck pig. What are you gonna do? Carry me out of here on your back? Hell. Just... Just give me a minute. Mm. Try to get some rest. There's a lot of stuff in here. I'll try to find something to help. Nah, fam. Nothing's... Oh, he was standing. Okay. <laughs> um, let me check my backpack. Uh, water. You want water, dude? <coughs> Anything in that 
Sorry, it's empty. Oh. <coughs> Damn. Help probably, looking around. Probably shouldn't have given that other guy water. I didn't know it was gonna make it empty. Whoops. What is this? Car keys? Uh oh. Out of gas. Damn it. No, radio's busted. Alright. Um. I think that's it, Clem. I think that's all we got over here. Yeah, search the box. What's in there? Anything we can use? Give me one of those. You probably taste like pine tar by now, but I'd smoke a dead coon's tail if you had one. You shouldn't. Why? <laughs> they gonna kill me? <laughs> Give me those. You got a light? Give me those. Brighten on my light. <laughs> well, that tastes about as bad as it smells. Now what? There we go. <sighs> we wait. Now you guys can see my pretty face. Dude, I cannot sleep sitting like that. I'd eventually fall over. Oh. Well, he's not... <laughs> this isn't really going to do much, but... Hey, Pete! Pete? <laughs> Why you gotta be so fucking oh, dead? I feel like ten pounds of shit in a five pound sack. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Oh. Stuck in this can the whole damn day. You want to hear something funny? No. I've been thinking. Oh. <laughs> I don't want to die. <laughs> I never thought I'd be the kind of idiot to say something like that. There it is. I'm scared, Clementine. Jesus, I'm scared. So you're going to be okay? Oh, at least spare me the bedside bullshit. <sighs> Sorry. Would you... Would you promise me you'll watch out for Nick? Yeah, Nick doesn't I love that get out of control. Kid. No matter what you think, he is a good boy. I'll do what I can. Yeah, there we Thank go. You. No, Pete will not I'm remember that. <laughs> they ain't gonna find us. Where are you going? He's gonna sacrifice himself for me. Or maybe not. I'm not getting out of this. You're gonna have to make a break for it. I'll buy you some time. Coming with me. Do what? Die a couple hours later than now? To say goodbye to Nick. <sighs> All right. I'll try. Yeah, man. There well, we go. Like my 
my daddy used to say. <sighs> We're burning daylight. Pull the pants down, boy. <laughs> Let's get this over with. Let's do it. Come on, man. Pull the lee. Hold out just for a little longer. Oh, well. <laughs> oh. Oh man. Yeah, he's dead. Poor old Pete. Rest in peace. Episode 2 House Divided. Are you all right? Yeah. Luke's not with you? Well, where's Alvin? What happened? It's been hours. Where are they? Clem. Pete got bit. What? What happened? Walker. I just said. <laughs> Thank God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there. Get the guns. Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. <sighs> Clementine, can you can you please watch Sarah? Yeah. She's upstairs. Just distract her and don't tell her anything. I'll take care of her. You can trust me. Thank you. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. And thank you. Alrighty then. Damn, dude. <laughs> what Say happened? Cheese. Oh. I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. Thank so cool. Thank you. <laughs> take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Um. Sure. sure. Got a distractor. Me in a good pose, okay? Okay, I'm ready. <sighs> Aw. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? Eating ass. He'll be fine. Are you sure? Yes. Just need to sit down. <laughs> the gurgles. Nice book. You want to see what I found? Will you show me how to use it? Oh, my God. I couldn't find any bullets. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? It's um, too dangerous. It's too dangerous. Yeah, everything is dangerous. I need to know sometime. You should let your dad teach you. Yeah. Hey. What should I shoot? Nothing. Do Jesus. I'm sorry. Sorry. Maybe I could practice outside. Maybe you can tree. put it down. Hey, Luke's back. That's. Oh, okay. Luke's back. Thank God, because <laughs> Sarah's about to pop some caps off in me. <laughs> Why the music is intense? I don't. Oh, that's not Luke. I don't really remember that's much. Oh, okay. I don't remember I much. Think 
I know him. From season two. He can't see me. You have to make him go away. Go and find somewhere to hide. Please have us be somewhere good. Where? No. Clem, I can't breathe. I, I can't breathe. Shh. Yeah, but I was about to say the same thing. Shush. Hello? Locked door. Hey, how about you don't? Who are you? Well, actually, I'm your neighbor. No, you're not. Neighbor? That's right. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? What's your name? <laughs> My name is George, honey. No, it's not. Pleasure to meet you. <laughs> you mind if I come in for a bit? No. Mm. I've been out all morning and this heat has got me cooked. Yes, I do mind. This is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. I'm alone. Really? Yeah. I take care of myself. Well, I'm impressed. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. No, they're not lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. A Spanish guy and his daughter. A quiet girl. A bit taller than you. Nope, now I haven't seen them. A black guy. This big. And a pretty little pregnant lady. That's a lot of people to lose. Tell me about it. This whole damn thing's a pain in the ass. Okay. <laughs> Dude, you need to stop searching my house. Yo, like... A lot of plates for one person. Looks like a tornado ran through here. I don't ever do the dishes. Hey, well, believe me, I don't either. Just passing through, or you've been here a while. Hey, listen, kid, I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri La. Just passing through, going north. A whole lot of people headed that way lately. Me, I don't get it. There's just as much nothing up there as there is down here. The cold slows them down. Well, that's not worth the trade, in my opinion. Oh, well, it looks like you already got a winter coat. I think you'll be fine. Where does this go? Oh, I'll take it. Oh, lordy. Well, this is a real nice place. Kind of cozy. Mm-hmm. This guy this guy's like a mix of I knew a guy that always wore shirts like this. Negan and Doctor. The governor. Real smug son of a bitch. But a smart man. I miss him. What happened to him? Let's just say we had our differences. Sooner or later, people close to you will find a reason to cross you. Happens every time. Oh yeah. Well well, White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? I don't know. It's the house. Houses creak all the time. <laughs> I thought you said nobody's here. Yeah, nobody is here. Nobody is here. Well, shit. Do you I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. 
didn't mean to be rude. Yeah, I mean, you didn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? Yeah, I guess. Sure. I guess so. I guess so. What? Who's this? Oh. Must be someone who lived here. Must be. You have no idea who these people are, do you? I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? What's your point? If people don't trust you, how can you trust them? I mean... Just get out of my house. Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. No. Myself out. But wait, who are you? You have a real good day now. Huh. He seriously is a mixture of the governor and Egan. I like it. Where is he? He's gone. What if he comes back? Uh -oh. Ah, that's right. I shouldn't have taken the picture because then he wouldn't have known that. But I think we find the others. regardless, we, we just outside? leave. Let me oh. time. Sarah, they told me about Pete. You know where he is, right? Come on, let's go. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm down, Rebecca. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. He was coming in either way. I told you not to open the door for anyone. I want to lock Did the door. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. Did he say his name? Yes. Yeah, but I think he was lying. What? I thought he said his name was George. George? Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? He had a big brown coat. Did it have a lining? A collar? Yeah, fur. He talked about you, Dad. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. Now, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy. Or not nice. Right? <laughs> you know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. Now, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? He saw a picture of you. Picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. You told me to distract her. Distract? Sarah. So I'm just an idiot? No. I thought we were friends. No, we are friends. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. Well, he was too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving now. Alvin, wait! We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. What does he want? To bring us back. Clem, I don't know what he told you, but William Carver is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Hell yeah. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. You have to leave. Okay. We have to find Pete. Hmm. We'll get him on the way out, Nick. Clementine, you know where he was, right? Yeah. Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. I know exactly where he was. He won't be there anymore. And you said it was just up here? Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem, sorry if I gave you some shit back there. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's just a 
tough time right now with the pregnancy and all. You and Alvin can probably relate. It's okay. If it's not you I'm yelling at lately, <sighs> it's Alvin. And then I'm in real trouble. I can handle it. I'm not a little kid. I felt the same way when I was your age. My dad was always giving me shit. And I always thought he didn't know a damn thing. <laughs> I know you did your best back there. You know, none of us would make it on our own. Sometimes it's hard knowing just how dependent I am on everyone. Yeah. I'm not used to that. I'm not comfortable with that. I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Alvin and I still don't know what to call her. Or him if that man gets his Him. Wish. God help me. Any ideas? Clem? <laughs> Bye. <laughs> uh, that, that was kind of rude of Clem, but eh, who cares? The baby is a him. It's Alvin Jr. There. That's where we were. It's not going to be in there. He's not in here. This was the last place I saw him. Maybe he's around here somewhere. Dead. <laughs> Keep your eyes open and stay in sight. Whew. I mean, the guy's already turned. Why should we have to look for him? Uh -oh. Pete! Anyone see him? Oof. Big oof. Oh my god. W what happened? What the hell happened? He's been shot. He didn't have a gun. Uh-oh. Who did this? Son of a bitch. We need to go. He's gone. May I keep me? He's gone. We gotta get moving. Come on, man. Come on, Nick. Jeez. Tell me. Tell me how it happened. The last thing he said was he wanted to say goodbye to you. He's gonna lag behind. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? Jesus. Uh... You sure you still want to come with us? Look, I know we got off to a rough start, and I can't make any promises it won't get rougher. Yeah, I'm with you guys. And we are glad to have you. Not everyone is. Well, they'll get there. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Now, if they're tracking us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay, Beth. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. Oh, baby. Let's do this. Oh. Oh, sorry, guys. I like literally just woke up technically 29 minutes ago as recording this. better see something we've been walking for a damn week we've got to find some shelter there's a building on the mountain what's it look like it's big 
That sounds like a good place to spend the night. Here, eat this back. There's a lift or something. Chairlift? Must be that ski resort. I've never been skiing. Beck and I went once. It wasn't pretty. Why is there echo in their voice? <laughs> There's a little house by the bridge. How big is it? I guess it's, it's pretty small. I guess it's supposed to be the echo. There's the bridge. And does it look passable? I think so. Good. We have to cross that bridge. Let's go. Okay. Hold on now. We can't all go sprinting across that thing, okay? We get spotted out there, we're gonna be trapped. Going around that lake will take too long. Right, but look, we've got no idea who's out there. Okay, I'm gonna sneak across, make sure it's clear before we bring the whole group over. All right. You think splitting up the group is a good idea? Yeah. Well, I never said it was a good idea, but it's better than risking everyone at once. What's your plan? Clem and I can scoot across low and slow, make sure nobody's waiting for us on the other side. We'll have a tough time covering you from back here. Well, we'll just turn back if it gets hairy. Clementine should stay here. She's... She's what? She's just a little girl, Luke. I can do it. See? <laughs> it's gonna be fun. Okay, we'll signal you guys in ten minutes. Just watch for a light at the far side. I can go too. No, Nick. You stay with the group. I'm fine, Luke. I don't like this. Yeah, well, when's the last time you liked anything, Carlos? If something happens, I'll cover you. Come on. Hey, uh, sorry about that. I just I could really use your eyes, and right now I don't trust Nick to tie his own shoes. You're just still on edge after the Carver thing. It's been five days. Why would Carver still be following us? What's the most important thing in this world? Um... What does everyone want? Safety. Safety? Close. Listen, what's the one thing a guy would walk hundreds of miles to get back? Family? Yeah. It's a tough world out there without people you can trust. I would say trust, or I would say safety anyway, is you, the most important. You can ask Rebecca, okay? I'm, I'm not going to get in the middle of it. We've all made mistakes. Done things that we regret. Not my place to talk about someone else's past, you know? I know what that's like. Yeah. Here we go. Ew. Hmm. Can't shoot them. Too much noise. There are only two. Let's take them. I like your style. I'll take the big one. You get shorter. I wish we could use guns. We should be okay. Got it. I'll take the small one. Good. Let's do it. All right. Here we go. <laughs> My hammer might be stuck. Go ahead. Give it a good pull. It should come free. I know. I've done this before, remember? In a shed. <laughs> Damn, Clum. There we go. Ooh. Nice work, kid. <laughs> Ow. Yeah, Luke, you ass. Oh, I love them. Perfect partners, man. Like Batman and Robin. You. I am behind us. Shit. Oh, 
Why didn't I get the... Oh, shit. Oh. There we go. Alright, alright, alright. Oh my god. Ooh. Ah. Down, 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 down. Okay. All right, I don't remember this part at all. <laughs> Go, Clem! Wait, there we go. There we go. Ew! 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 <laughs> Oh my god, Luke. Oh my god. Dude, I don't remember that at all. <laughs> that was actually that was actually stressful. Let's keep going. Dude, I would need to sit there for like five, ten minutes. That that would be way too stressful. What? You see him? Yeah. Yeah. Just play it cool. And you do the talking. What? Why me? I don't want to get in a fight. You really think he chewed a little girl? Just don't make any sudden moves. And don't piss him off. Don't tell him anything. What should I say? Well, then what should I, I say? Know. Ask him for directions. Well, who are you? Well, who's asking? I am. I'm Clementine, and this is Luke. Clementine and Luke. Uh -huh. You don't look like assholes. <laughs> Are you assholes? No. No offense or anything, but you know how it is out here. You run into a lot of assholes. I'm not an asshole. Well, are you calling me an asshole? <laughs> you folks headed north like everyone else? Everyone else? I see at least one group a day move through here. They all look the same. It's like a great migration of the days been confused. Do you know Carver? Carver? Like George Washington Carver? The peanut guy? <laughs> He's a man. Never heard of him. But no, I want some peanut butter, though. <laughs> I gotta say, you two look like shit. If you need food, I've got some canned stuff in that station back there. Well, that's uh, awful nice of you. What's the catch? No catch. I've got plenty. Well, all right then. Thank you. Hey, no problem. Nice running into friendly faces out here. Like I said, I've got food and supplies back in the station. And if you want... What the fuck, man? What? The hell is he doing? Nick? Ah, okay. No, 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 no. He's, he's with us. Nick! No! Put it down! Oh my god, Nick.
Did I hit him? Where is he? I told you not to shoot. What? Who was that guy? Why didn't you wait for a signal? He was going to help us. How do you know? We were talking to him. I told you not to shoot. How was I supposed to hear you? You gave me a clear shot. That shot rang out for miles. We gotta get off this bridge. Let's go. Nick. Nick. It's gonna be hard to look after you when you do stupid shit like that. Oh my god. Who the fuck was that back there? A very nice man. Looked like he had a gun on you. That asshole drew on me. No. He was about to shoot. Oh, I mean. Oh, was he? No. I'm telling you, man, he drew first. Well, that's not what it looked like to me. Shut up, Nick. Yeah, no, Nick, just shut up. What did you see, Clem? Is that guy gonna shoot? No. Fuck you, Luke. You've been on my case the whole week. And why do you think that is, Nick? He wasn't gonna do anything. I know what I saw. Either way, you could have hit one of us. Yeah, but I didn't. Look, I I know Pete was close to you, Nick, but you can't don't fucking talk about him. You think he was with Carver? No. I don't know. I No, I don't think so. But he fell over. He fell off the damn bridge? We have to keep moving. I can't. I need a minute. Fine. Luke, can I talk to you alone? Yeah, let's uh leave Nick on his own. He can die. I hate Nick. I hate him. Grr. I'm angry, girl. Hey, Clem, you got anything to eat? Bex is dying here. Okay, then I let her die. You, I'm fine. <laughs> Sorry, I'm out. Wish we still had those juice boxes. Yeah, me too. That man said he had food in the station. Mind checking it out? Maybe we could spend the night here. A little small for us, though. You could use a little downsizing. Sure. Thanks, Clem. Alright, let's go say sorry to Nick. I feel bad. But, like, dude, come on. I had to kill my mom. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sounds weird when I say it out loud, huh? Luke always used to push me. I never wanted to go into business with him. I remember when he sold me on his big plan. Some fucking plan. Case of beer in, he just said, Nick, we're burning daylight. And that was that. After six months, we were flat broke. I didn't care. We were having fun. I wish I was like him. I wish I could just keep moving all the time. I'm just not built like that. I'm sure they're talking about me right now. Luke, he's becoming a danger to the group. <laughs> Who was that guy? I swear. It looked like he was holding you guys up. I figured he was with Carver. No. Damn. If Alvin is in front of me, he takes that shot. Maybe I am losing it. I don't know anymore. God, I'm hungry. What time is it anyway? Damn. Damn. What's wrong? Well, I left my watch back at the cabin. It was Pete's. Oh. He gave it to me. That's all I had left of him. You know what? I'm gonna go talk to them. Of course Nick's hungry, but Nick's not gonna get the food. The pregnant lady's gonna get the food. My god. What's this? A radio? It's dead. I guess he slept here. Survival knife? Oh. I probably shouldn't take that if that's his. Feels pretty good. I don't need it. God damn it, Clum. Hmm. 
There we go. Food. There's two cans. Man, not thought we had a bed. Look at this dump. <laughs> Guess he did have food. Man, fuck me. Nick's lost a lot of his people, that's for sure. But that doesn't give him any excuse to start shooting up strangers. He was trying to help us. Yeah, and someone died. I ain't no judge, but that's straight up murder in my book. It's I mean, the apocalypse. You ever know do a thing like that? I don't want to talk about it. That's funny. She looks just like you. <laughs> hey, Clem, there's not a lot of food here, and Rebecca, well, she's eating for two. You think we can keep this just between us? I hate to even say it, you know, but, and I'd never go against the group. Yeah, uh, yeah. Rebecca can have it. I won't say anything. Thanks, Clementine. It's a shame. Nick was a good guy. He's still a good guy. He's just losing it. Yeah. God knows we're not perfect. Hell, I'm glad you're with us, Clementine. Aw, oh, thank you, Alvin. The hell is that? What? Oh, we need to leave. Walkers. You got a problem here. Yeah, we saw it. All right, we're heading up. Well, shit. I wonder if there is a way to save that guy. Well, what are we waiting for? We have to be careful. Careful? We've been on the road for five days. My back is done being careful. <laughs> Doesn't look like anybody's home. Damn. Nail down tight. I'll check around front. I'll go with you. Well, it'd be good to know if anybody's actually back there. Probably get a better view from up top. You'd have an easier cool. time getting up there. You feel like taking a look? It'd be just like climbing a treehouse. And just a, a really tall treehouse. I had a treehouse once. Well, there you go. I hated it. <laughs> Yeah, well, Clem, that treehouse kept you safe until Lee came, so, uh, be quiet. <laughs> I'd literally do everything for this group. Just take it slow, and I'll catch you if you fall. Probably. <laughs> Got a good grip? Yeah. When I was a kid, we used to jump rooftops downtown. Now that was fun. Now that was fun. That sounds stupid. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it was. The trick was not to look down, though. Ooh, okay. Oh, oh, you're fine. You're fine. Just look at me, okay? You're, you're fine. All right, just, just slow down just for a second, okay? You just told me not to look. Good point. <laughs> All right. Ooh, very pretty. Made it. <laughs> Made it. Ah! Uh, is that the bridge we came from? Oh my god, that's so far. I can see the bridge. Oh. Uh-oh. There's light. Wait, I see something. What is it? A light. But wait, there's another. Luke. Luke. Uh oh. Even though I played this before, I, like I don't know why, I, I still get surprised by s some things. I mean, I've only played this once before, so. Uh 
Listen, everyone, just stay calm. Who are you? Who are, are you? Trying to rob us? Excuse me, honey, but do I look like a fucking thief? Yeah. Everyone, calm down. Hey, man, you calm the fuck down. Sarah, get behind just me. Just tell us who you are. We ain't here to rob nobody. Put the gun down, fuck man. Fuck that. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, just do what he says. Kenny. <laughs> Wait, you know this guy? Clementine? Aww. Don't play that music. God damn it. I'll take that as a yes. These people with you? Yes. We can talk inside. Great. I just started dinner. Oh, man. I'm sure you don't mind. It's gonna storm soon. Please, come in. Yeah, you can turn this music off now. That'd be great. That'd be great. I love Kenny. Bit of a psycho, but I love him. So pretty. Merry we quit math. <laughs> Kenny and Sarita have been staying with us for several weeks. It used to be a ski lodge, obviously, so we have plenty of food. And uh, believe it or not, we still get some power from that wind turbine out front. We tend to keep most of the lights off at night to avoid drawing attention. But after we found this stuff in storage, we couldn't resist making an exception. <laughs> it's funny. Oh, nothing, Walt. <laughs> What's Walter funny? Here's one smart some bitch. Makes a mean can of beans too. Well, why don't you two catch up while I get some dinner started? All right. Please make yourselves at home. You can leave your things over there. The hell we will. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm holding on to my rifle. No, you're not. Thanks. You're our guests here. There's no need to worry. Tell him to put his gun down then. Kenny. Do you vouch for these people, Clamp? Of course I do. Everyone you but tell Nick. me they're good, then I'm us. You were the one waving a gun around, man. They're cool. Dad, look! A Christmas tree. Well, now, sorry. Copyright claims of the We found it all in storage. It's amazing. Sharpen that machete. Ah. Good. If you'll all follow me, I'll show you where you can sleep. A knife. Still wearing this dirty old thing, huh? Yeah. You know, I half expected to see Lee walk up next to you. You guys were like two peas in a pod. Oh, shit, I didn't mean to. It's just hard not to think about it, you know? Yeah. He saved me. I knew it. I knew he would. That guy had a fire in him, sure as shit. Even though you didn't bother to go with him to help him out. Well, Lee and I had our differences, that's for sure. But for my son, he took care of him. I'll never forget that. So, where'd you end up? I was with Krista and Omid. Omid, well, Krista and I were together for a while. These guys caught us. She's gone. Sounds like it ain't been easy for you. Mm -mm. I'm sorry, darling. 
I wish I could have found you sooner. But everything's gonna be fine now. Where have you been? Oh, hell. All over after Savannah. How did you get out of there? For some reason, I tried to save that fucking shitbird there. <laughs> then it turned into a damn cluster. Couldn't help the kid, but I got out. Long story short, I got lucky. Real lucky. Spent a long time alone after that. Until now. And then I met Serena. <laughs> Gosh, it's great to have you back. You two catching up? Clem, this is my girl, Sarita. Ain't she beautiful? Nice yeah. to meet you, Clementine. <sighs> hey, Walt, where's Matthew? He's still out there rooting around? Of course he is. Well, I'll start dinner. Carlos, uh. right? Mind if I steal your daughter for a secret mission? Stay in sight, sweetie. Can we do anything to help? Could use a hand outside. We've got a lot of supplies to bring in before that storm hits. Sure. Clem, why don't you help Walt with dinner? Mm -hmm. oh. His other group member that's not hey, here Clementine. right now is who we killed. Settling in well enough? Yeah, thanks. Excellent. Wanna help me prepare a little dinner? No. So how do you know Kenny? He and Sarita have been a huge help. Matthew and I barely knew what to do around here the first week. It's a long story. Connecting with people is so important. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. Gosh, you remind me of my students. I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. It sucks. <laughs> it hasn't been easy. I can imagine. It's hard enough as an adult. Hmm. Almost done. Would you do me the honor of tasting the first course, madam? Looks great. It looks like mush. No, it doesn't. Mm -mm -mm. As an artist, there's nothing I like less than a friendly critic. <laughs> Striking resemblance. Oh my god. Stop. Anyway, I'll take it from here. Look around the lounge. Okay. What is this? A CD. A CD player. Oh, we probably shouldn't be playing music. That's for sure. Dinner table? Oh. <laughs> Who the fuck is singing? I haven't seen a song you're having since Wood King Wenceslas. It's my favorite Christmas song. Thanks for interrupting me, Sarah. It's a Time to interrupt well, your conversation. Here, Sarah, you take this and string them up over there. You knew Kenny before. It must be incredible to see him again. Yeah. When I met him, well, he's so different now. You must be so glad. Did he say anything about before? No. He won't talk about before I met him. Oh. Everything takes a little coaxing these days. Yeah. Perfect. Now we just need the topper. We always had an angel on top of our tree. My family didn't celebrate Christmas, but I still love the decorations. Find a tree topper. The fuck can I find a tree topper in this place? That's not a tree topper. That's a regular decoration. Yeah, 
anything? Would the tree tapper be upstairs? It's crazy. Why would they follow us this far? You can't be sure. It's been a week, man. We gotta be out of the woods. You can't be sure. They might be tracking us. Tracking? What do you think they are? Ninjas? Yes. Slim, <laughs> Luke said you saw some people in the valley. People? Way down there. How? I saw lights. Which way did they go? Back yeah. into the woods. We cannot take any chances. We leave at dawn. But we're safe here for tonight, right? Clementine, you talked to that man Walter, right? What did he say? You didn't tell him anything about us, did you? We have to be careful. We mostly talked about Kenny. Kenny is the loud man with the beard? Yeah, yeah. that's him. Look, I don't care what that man said. We're staying here tonight. Just talk to the rest of them. They trust you. See what you can find out. Man, I do go find Luke. everything Honey, for this group. Feel so good. Heck, what's wrong? I just need something to she just got Thanos yeah. snapped. I'll be right back. She's about to disappear. Uh, we'll grab the angel for Sarah. Look at that. She looks so cool. Shut up, Sarah. <laughs> Beautiful. Uh, I used to love this time of year. I used to love you know, this time now of that year. My friends are here. This place is starting to feel like a real home. Just get some Matthew bullet to the head. Are amazing people. Honestly, it's dangerous to be this kind, but they can't help it. Wait until you meet Matthew. He's a real character. First time he met me, he called me Rita. What does Matthew look like? Oh, he's a handsome man. A little shorter than Walter. He should be back soon. Clem, I wanted to ask you, does Kenny seem different to you? I didn't know him before, and, well, I'm curious. He seems like the same old Kenny to me. Oh, well, that's good. Well, you three have been busy. Kenny, isn't it great? I got it, huh? I think I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. All right. <laughs> Always has to play the gentleman. But I'll tell you, when I met him, he couldn't lift a fly. Why don't you go see if your friends are ready for dinner, Clementine? Why is Kenny gotta be so damn got got goddamn rude? All right. Hi, Rebecca. How's okay. Alvin Jr. doing? <laughs> Just got a little dizzy. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I mean, how can anyone now? I think it's possible. How do you know? Okay. Well, I'm well, trying to be nice. I'm still here. I know it's going to be hard. But at the same time, I already feel a little less lonely. Because I know that no matter what happens, I'll get to meet someone new. Hell yeah. She's kicking. Wanna listen? That food smells good, huh? Can I? She's gonna be a runner. <laughs> or like he's gonna be a pain in my ass. It's not his. <laughs> Whose is it then? If Alvin finds out, he'll kill me. I don't know what to do. I can't believe I'm asking a little girl for advice. But I guess nothing's real anymore. He won't kill you. There's my man. You all right, baby? I'm fine, you big dope. Just need to get some food in me. Yikes. <laughs> Thanks for staying with her, Clem. Well, everyone, dinner is served. The kid's not well, yours. Please. What? Nothing. <laughs> Let's go eat. He 
Yeah, eat them beans. Mmm. <laughs> you okay, man? Yeah. Just... I wish I hadn't pulled that trigger. Yeah, don't just talk. Don't forget about it. Just don't talk about it. Right here, Clem. Oh, shit. You're gonna make me choose. Um... Um, I don't know why this is a hard decision. <laughs> I want to sit with Luke because he's my homie. I don't want to sit with Kenny because he's my homie. Hmm. Here. Kenny, Luke. <laughs> Kenny, Luke. Eeny, meeny, my emo. <laughs> my mother told me to pick the very best one and you are not it okay so we sit with luke <laughs> i'm sorry ken if i remember correctly he comes and sits at our table anyway so what's the deal with your friend here yes we were just talking about this kenny what do you make of him clem he's a good guy even though i didn't sit with him I trust him. With your life? Yep. I think so. I know so. Walter was telling me his family died. That's horrible. A thing like that can hit a guy pretty hard. Yeah. He lost his whole family? Wife and kid. Damn. He did the best he could. I'm sure he did. It was really hard on everyone. I bet. Hey, Kenny. Hey there. Hey. Hope you like the food. Oh, it's it's great. Thank you. Peaches and beans. Great for nutrition. Not too great on the way out, though. I tell you. <laughs> so it's Luke. And Nick. Luke and Nick. You guys sure do look like a match. What's that supposed to mean? I'm just saying you look like good friends, that's all. So, what was your plan here? Hold out for the winter? Actually, we were thinking of moving on. Somewhere up north. You ever heard of a place called Wellington? Yes. Wellington? The hell is that? A place. Yeah. Krista and I were going there. It's supposed to be a big camp up near Michigan. Michigan? You got a hearing problem, kid? Yeah, Michigan. Think about it. Fresh water, lots of land. Cold-ass winter, so the walkers get slow. Sounds like bullshit. Listen, Vanilla Ice. I don't know <laughs> what your deal is, but you're more than welcome to take off in the morning. And that'd be just fine by me. What's the deal with these guys, Clem? Hey, fuck you, buddy. Okay. It's fine, Nick. We're not staying. She's staying. Huh, excuse me? Please, don't fight. Gentlemen, please. There's no need for this. Yeah. Now look, we've all had a long day. Please eat. Ooh. Ask me that can, duck. Ooh, shit. Duck? Who's duck? Was his son. Hey Clementine, would you uh lend me a hand outside for a moment? Sure. Get out of this awkward situation. Anything to get out of that situation. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry about that. No, nah, you're, you're good. Teacher. I remember what it's like to be caught in the middle of two clicks. I suspect they'll find common ground soon enough. It may oh, take yeah. a little time, but that's just how these things work. Everything will be fine. Of course. Also, guys, thanks for. Oh. Are like any machine. You don't throw them out when they break down. I want to stay. I want to stay. And stay you shall. I know that'll please Kenny. I missed him. And he missed you. I can assure you. Well, I want to have everybody stay. I want to stay at this, the world is over. at this lodge. I'll tell you a secret. It's not. 
People are more political now than they ever were before. In the end, we can't change the world. All we can do is continue to learn from each other, to empathize and use our heads. All war is a symptom of man's failure as a thinking animal. Steinbeck, have you read him? Well, we have plenty of time to catch you. I up. don't read. My partner Matthew is amassing quite the literature collection. I think you'll like him. In any case, the point is, as long as we have our wits about us, we can always make the right choice. Right? Right. This guy's so cool. What's the matter, Clementine? Is there something you want to tell me? No. You can talk to me, Clem. There's almost nothing you could tell me that would surprise me. I can promise you that. I'm just worried about the people chasing us. You're safe now. Don't worry. Matthew will be back soon. Dude. And everything will be fine. Hey, kids. This what guy, are you two talking This guy about? is obsessed with Matthew. Oh, politics? The hell? <laughs> Being from Florida, I would imagine you know all about politics, Kenny. Man, I know one advantage of living in the apocalypse is not dealing with that shit no more. I was just gonna check the windows. Hey, man, brother. This storm hits. Give us a hand. Sure. Yeah, politics are fucking boring. Whoa, woman. Hi. Miss. Please, do you have any food? Are you okay? I saw the house and I have a family. We're starving. We live down there. Uh, of course. Why don't you come in, Miss... Fire! <coughs> Walt, I don't know. We're just gonna let her in like that? It's fine, Kenny. We don't know this girl. Then we'll have to get to know. Right, Clem? Walt, how much damage can this poor woman do? Um... She can't hurt anyone. Look at her. It's like when they're outside, there's an echo in their voice. It's weird. Thank you. Really, but that storm will be on us soon, and I gotta get back to my family. I'll bring something out to you, then. You don't have to do that. No, no, it's fine. What about your people? We've got plenty. You stay put. I'll be right back. <laughs> Clem. <sighs> I know she's lying, but... I have a little girl like you no you don't you're lying how old are you sweetie um i'm 11. i would have thought older than that here you are miss this is too much don't mention it i don't know how to thank you just help someone else down the line. Thank you so much. I'll be going now. You stay safe. You too. Clem, go on inside and get to bed. Walt and I gotta talk for a second. Stupid son of a bitch. Why? Why you do that? Freak out. Okay, Luke. I'm a gun. Listen, I gotta tell you something. What? That guy on the bridge was Walter's friend. Man, who would have thought? <laughs> See, I knew something was off, so I asked Rita about their friend. Now they're all worried he's not back yet. Where's Nick? I don't know. Well, we should tell him. I don't think Walter knows yet, so we have to keep this quiet. I mean, who knows what the hell he'd do if he found out. What if he finds out anyway? Well, then we're fucked. But, you know, we'll just... We'll just deal with it then. Now, do you, uh... You still have that knife? Because if it was Matthews and Walter sees it, he's gonna put two and two together. It's with the other weapons. Okay, well, go get rid of it. I'll find Walter and run interference. Oh, and uh, keep an eye out for Nick. I'm right here. What's up? Uh, well. <laughs> oh, uh, there's nothing, man. I just wanted to check and see if you're okay. You coming to tuck me in? 
<laughs> yeah, yeah, something like that. Nothing. Hey, if there's something going on, I want to know. No, just go back to bed, Nick. I'm serious. You guys can talk to me. I know. Okay. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. God damn it. Hey, Nick, shut the fuck up. I can't, man. I can't. Do not fucking blow it. <laughs> blow it. It's over. I have to tell him, Luke. What? No, you can hey, Nick, you cannot do that. You fucking nuts. I gotta. I can't live with that on me. Okay, I hear you, but I mean, fuck, man. Do you know what he's gonna do? Either way is risky. Exactly. Jesus. I can't handle this. Look, Clem, just go do that thing, alright? No problemo. Um, where's the knife? Where's all my shit? It's gone. Oh, yeah. He found it. <laughs> Clum's face. Oh, fuck. <laughs> this year, noob sheets. like this knife. Mm. Gave it to Matthew when all this started. I know he's dead. Who did it? Was it that, that kid? What's his name? Uh, Nick? Heard him talking earlier. Something about shooting a man. I could see it. Mm. I could see it on his face. I wasn't sure then. But now? It was us. It was our fault. Jesus. I, um. Uh, I don't feel good. Hey, man, you just, uh. Put the knife down. Hmm. Is Nick a good man? I would say yes. He just like everyone else. He is. He's a good guy, Walter. Yeah, you might want to go. Walter was going on alone. I told him something like this would happen, but he wouldn't listen. No, Matt always knew best. What's going on? You need to tell him. Tell him what? You know exactly what. what. Happened on the bridge. Ugh. Tell me what you did. Just tell me, son. Tell me what happened. From a distance, it looked like anyone. I, I, I thought I thought he was gonna shoot my friends, and I I shot Matthew. But, but, but it happened real fast. I didn't I didn't know if I hit him, but I did, and I didn't mean to. You know what you've done to me. Do you have any idea? I didn't mean to. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Walter. Oh, what is he gonna do with that knife? Oh. Uh oh. Well, what's going on? Got it spinning out of control. That sound's gonna draw walkers. We gotta shut it down now. Hey, help me. Carry the guns. Guns? Yeah, guns. Welcome to the apocalypse. <laughs> Ding's a damn dinner bell. Ding ding. Bing bing bong. All right. Oh, fuck. Transformer must have gone. Gotta check it. 
I could use a hand. I'll go with you. I'm going to. No! It's too dangerous. The rest of you, get this thing shut down. Easy. Easy peasy. Does anyone know how to do this? No. <laughs> Watch your back. Nick, scan the trees with me. All right. Um, there we go. Take that. Well, that was easy. Uh oh. Something ain't right. Yeah, the moaning in the woods and the groaning. We don't have much ammunition. We gotta get back to the lodge. Yeah, let's start going now. They're behind us. Just go. The way to the lodge is open. <laughs> well, now it's not. Because you guys decided to take your time. Okay. Okay. There we go. Well, I'm out. Hey, oh. Oh, God. I would have moved that zombie, but... Okay, okay, okay. Oh, square. There we go. Please help me. Oh, Walt. Oh. Walt's a good guy. That bitch, that lion bitch. Howdy, folks. Where's Rebecca? Harbor. It's nice to see you too. Oh. Well, Sarah. oh, 
stressful. It's you. Keep moving. Yeah, I feel bad. You mother trucker. Feel bad. Yeah, it's really nice, actually. Get up the stairs, Alvin. Leave this fucking place, Bonnie? Power and everything. A lot of windows, though. Ooh. Fucking huge. Filters hate it. Now the rest of them could be anywhere. And how the fuck are we gonna cover these guys and look for them too? Johnny, cover that window. Go, <laughs> oh, Clem, jeez. Of safety. I know you're out there. No. And Alvin, and Luke, and the girl. This is real simple. You want this over quick. You all play nice and show your faces. I can't, You'll kill him. No, Alvin. We gotta go down there. I can't do that. Back the baby. You need a doctor. No. Where's Luke and Kenny? You may have to help Carlos. The only way to help him is to do what the man says. What about Luke and Kenny? Look at those guns. If he starts shooting, and people are gonna die on both sides. Yeah, seriously. Uh, ah, uh, ah. Clem can sneak out. Find Luke. What the hell is she gonna do? And you heard him? Carver knows she's with us. Just stop! Don't hurt my dad, please! We're going down there. He'll kill you. Fuck you. Shoot him! Somebody just shoot him! Okay. Clem, go get help. Don't kill him, Beck. Don't do it anyway. You don't know that. Um. Say goodbye, Carlos. He's gonna kill him. Rebecca, we have to give up. Bill, stop! Ah. 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 <laughs> I mean. Rebecca could have been the one to come down, and then Alvin and me could have been up there. You don't want to do this. Please let these people go. Just shut up. <laughs> wow. Oh God, his fingers. Could you reach my hands? Ugh. Everything under control. Oh shit. Kenny. Don't move. I can't see him. Watch them. Ah, oh, fuck, not Walt. Oh, 
Oh. Another one of your friends out here, and I'm gonna put a bullet in the back of their head. Ah! Or you can give up now. Your choice. Ah, that's loud. God damn it, Kenny. Hi, Elvin. You motherfucker. Elvin. No, no. Tell him to stop. Kenny, stop. You remember George, Alvin? You see, I do. I remember a guy that was your friend named George. I remember when you murdered him in cold blood. Why? Because you didn't like me? You could have lodged a complaint. You could have... You could have been civil. Bill, no! We'll do whatever you want! Kenny! Move! Don't shoot! Ah. Ah. Huh. Ah. That's not what I wanted to happen. can do this all night. Is that what you want? Thank you, Kenny. Where's Luke? Finally cut and run, huh? Why am I not surprised? I warned you. I warned you not to follow him. Look where he's led you. Mm. But you're safe now. No. You're going home. As a family. <laughs> All right, round him up. We're heading back to camp. dead it's too freaking good it's too freaking good why does clementine look like she's smiling oh never mind never mind <laughs> i don't know if we could have saved walt but i know one of us didn't just give up yeah i know folks are sore over Oof. Well, let's remember these are our brothers and sisters and they all have a vital role to play in this community. They strayed from the flock, yeah. That don't mean they can't earn their way back into the fold. That don't mean we can't find it in our hearts to forgive them, knowing full well those who choose not to accept our love. I sure he wished they had. The storm is Uh oh. All right, uh, took blame for Sarah's photo. You and 51.5% of players blame someone else. <laughs> really? Okay. Who did you sit with at the dinner? You and 35.8% of players sat with Luke. Well, I see, I did the eeny, meeny, miny, mo, and the mo said to sit with Luke, so. <laughs> um, uh, told Walter the truth about Matthew and 56% of players told Walter the truth. Really? So that's like half and half? The other half didn't tell him the truth? That's kind of screwed up, man. Nick's fate, you and 56.3% of percent, yeah, percent of players uh, convinced Walter to forget Nick. This is like all 50-50 except for the second option. Left to find Kenny, you and 56.1% of players stayed to help Carlos. Yeah. Of course I did. Yeah, we're just gonna skip that. All right. All right, guys. That was episode two of Telltale's The Walking Dead season two. If you guys did enjoy, leave a like. 
If you are new to my channel, make sure you do hit that subscribe button. Also, make sure you hit that little bell so you guys get notifications when I stream upload to my channel. If you guys want to watch me play through Season 1, 3, or 4, all that is going to be under the playlist tab um, on my channel that you guys can click or tap on. Scroll through and you'll find my Season 1 playthrough, my Season 3 playthrough, and my Season 4 playthrough. Um, but yeah... Uh, thank you guys so much for the support on the videos lately. Sorry I haven't been streaming much. I just feel like streaming isn't a thing I want to be doing right now. I think I just want to focus on making videos and, uh, and just doing that. You know, making videos, editing when I feel like it. Because I don't really think editing is that much of a, is that big of a deal on my, for my channel right now. I think just trying to get as many videos out as possible is what matters. So that's why when it comes to editing, there really isn't much other than cutting out certain parts of the video that aren't really needed in the video. So yeah, that's uh, that, that's why there hasn't really been any streams. I, I It's not that I don't like to stream. I love streaming. I just think I need to focus on making videos right now than trying to make sure that I get one stream or one or two streams in, you know. But I promise streams will be coming back. It's just uh, I, I really need to focus on making videos right now. So yeah. Uh, thank you guys for the support. Uh, hope you guys enjoy episode 2. Episode 3 will be going up soon as well. I'm going to try and finish this game before Last of Us Part 2 comes out in ooh, pretty soon. It, it's soon. It's like 20, 19, 20 days left till the game comes out. So we're getting there. We're getting there. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy. I'll see you guys next one. Goodbye, everybody.